anyway, come along. Come on into the room and join us in our living room. Sing along. Probably number, oh, about 112, something like that. We had 110 here a little while back. Didn't make much to do about it. I'm trying to get him loaded up on the YouTube. And what's that? 210. Is that, did I say 110? Oh, 210. Yeah. So anyway, we are glad that you are here tonight and joining us. And people are coming in from Goshen and Burden Hand, Pennsylvania, Cottonwood, Texas, Cadillac, Michigan. There is Missouri and the Millers. And hello there, Mr. Beitzel from Washington. Good to see you guys coming in, State College, PA. And we're going to just sit down and have some good old time of singing, kick your shoes off, grab a bowl of popcorn, and relax along with us as much as you can. If you got a story or two, I wish you could tell it. <laughs> I guess you can't really. Well, you could put a comment on. We might catch it. That's what's happening with these comments. They come in and go flying by, and sometimes we see them, sometimes we don't. What's really funny for me is... Sometimes I see the comments go by, and I think, oh, I'm going to say something by the end of the song. But by the end of the song, I forgot what I was going to say about it. <laughs> so it's getting old, I'm telling you. Hey, our house is sounding empty. Hey, that, that probably does affect the sound. We have more of an echo. We, it's getting empty. This dear lady, she's packing like crazy. Lord willing, June the 6th or June the 4th or 3rd or 4th, we'll be loading the old truck, and we're having them at the same time, and... Wow, it's going to be, we, I'll tell you, right, when I think about that, it looks like a big old mountain that the Lord's going to have to line things up. Hello, Lancaster, PA, Mount Joy, PA. So you folks are kind of settling in for the night back there. And yes, Fanny was right. The work's never done. Hi, sister. Here we are. This is children's, well, I'll tell you what, let's sing a couple songs first of all. What do you want to sing about? I want to sing about peace tonight. Peace and rest. <laughs> peace I leave with you. My peace I give to you. God as the world gave up, give I unto you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. Peace I leave. For the kids, it's uh, not here. Uh oh. It's over there. Uh, well, I'll tell you what, popcorn. You just go ahead and get dressed up, and we'll start. We don't blow the horn tonight. In the, in the top shelf there. Oh, I see it. It's on the left hand side. You can go around the front of the camera. No, that wouldn't be a good idea, would it? Hey, our tech man got it for me, Mr. Techie Trevor. Trevor Techie. <laughs> Getting something makes you techie, right? <laughs> Kids, come on in. We're going to the mansion on a happy day express. The letters on the engine spell J E S U S. So join us in this sing along and gladly answer yes. We're going to the mansion on a happy day express. Yeah, all right. 
we have some requests. Hey, let's start with that oldie goldie. Oh, never mind. We'll do this one. We want to do a home in glory land. Yeah, first. All right. Oh yeah, sure. Absolutely. Hey, okay, we're gonna sing "Running Over" for Daisy. Hey, Miss Daisy, she's our hometown hero here. Well, not hometown hero. She's our living room sing along hero. She hails from well down south. Oh, out Missouri. Okay. Hey, we get to meet Daisy, don't we? Woohoo! I love it. Anyway, this is for you, Daisy. Let me see. We're gonna do it in the key of A. Running over, running over. My cup is full and running over. Since the Lord saved me, I'm as happy as can be. My cup is full and running over. Let's go up to C. Running over, running over. My cup is full and running over. Since the Lord saved me, I'm as happy as can be. My cup is full and running over. Hey, Daisy, thinking about cups, you ever hear this one? Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to Him belong, they are weak, but He is strong. Fill up my cup, fill it up, let it overflow. Fill up my cup, fill up my cup. here. Hi, Popcorn. Welcome to the doggy house. <laughs> to the sing-along. Here's another one. This is a good, this is a campfire song where you just kind of got to get excited and clap your paws, Popcorn. I got a home in glory land that upshines the sun. Yeah. I got a home in glory land that upshines the sun. I got a home the bed for the kids? You want to do that one yet or not? Yeah, let's do that one anyway. This is about being back in, stuck in COVID at Grandma's house, or when Grandma came to live at our house to the tune of, and with apologies to, John Denver. Grandma's feather bed when I am just a little bitty boy been stuck home a month or so. School is closed, can't play with my friends, time seemed to pass so slow. But Grandma lives here at our house, then one day she said, You kids all come at 6 p.m. and we'll gather around the old feather bed. It was nine feet high and six feet wide, it's almost eight feet long. Just enough of room for all to climb in and join in a sing-along. In hail it gives a four-hound dog and a piggy we stole from the shed. We raised our voices in praise to Jesus in Grandma's feather bed. Mom and Dad came up to see what the fuss was all about. How did you kids all get in there? And who left the little pig out? But Grandma said to Mom and Dad, we're making a joyful noise. Me and the house and the wee little pigs and all you girls and boys. It was nine feet high and six feet wide and almost eight feet long. Just enough 
the room for all to climb in and join in the sing along. It held a kid for a hand dog, a thingy we stole from the shed. We praised our sweet voices and praise to Jesus in Grandma's better bed. Once they sang about a dog in the window, we heard a doggy bark. Arr! Four hound dogs perked up their ears, they didn't know it was Mark. The dogs took the hound, the pigs started squealing and running all over the place. We all laughed and laughed, we laughed so hard the feather bed began to shake. Someday I'll forget about this old virus and how it filled us all with dread. But I always will remember that fun sing along in Grandpa's big feather bed. It was nine feet high and six feet wide, almost eight feet long. Just enough of room for all to climb in and join in the sing along. It held a kid's four hand dog and a piggy we stole from the shed. We raised our voices in praise to Jesus in Grandpa's feather bed. We raised our kids song tonight and you guessed it we've not done it in a long time we're going to ask how much that dog is for sale in the winter mm. in the winter i said winter i like that what's that popcorn is scared we're going to sell it we won't sell you popcorn that's another doggy you better stick around how much is that doggy in the window Trevor. Yeah, Trevor should tell us a little bit. He was down to, uh, where were you, Trevor? Tell us about it. I was for, down at Brownsville Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. For Came youth? on Sunday afternoon. Youth meetings, and they were called what? Sold out. Sold out. 
And you got some stuff down there. Do you still have it out? We can show it to us? No? Back in the room. All right. Well, you can leave it there. And there, who was there? Oh, there's his sold out cup. It's a really cool, uh, really cool um, uh, series of meetings. That, well, it's more than cool. It's wonderful. It's uh, Rick Rhodes Ministry. I don't know. Is that the, what, what uh, him and his family um, do this every once in a while? So they were down in the about, oh, that's about an hour and a half from here, I think. And uh, Trevor spent two nights down there with some of his buddies and, and uh, also with um, Larry and Margaret. They, they let him hang out there. So that was great. So yeah, good Lord's been working on us and uh, makes us want to be sold out for Jesus. Amen. Nelson, you might have to uh, turn your phone off and back on. Then it yeah, might be okay. sometimes that does it, Nellie. Okay. Eleanor Yoder and Daisy wanted Amazing Grace. All right, two of them. All right, let's do it. Amazing Grace. side of me my tummy. all right hold on guys we're going to do some technical work here if we can i don't know what we could do here about this whole mess here but it is what it was. oh man the cord wasn't in right and it isn't in now i think let's do this again here and see what happens oops wrong way oh you're right it broke it's staying down oh it came all the way off now on for stendy this is not looking good for an old Dutchman. We'll do it this way, I reckon. See what happened with this. Hold on a little bit, guys. We need some technical assistance here. Our, our holder, I just told him, Ruth, tonight we got to buy a new one. There, sir. I'm looking for my capo. Right there on that. Oh, line. there it is. Yep. Yeah. All right. Well, we're making some adjustments. My capo is going to double up as a clamp. <laughs> See how that works. Whoops, wrong way. We're going to try this so that it doesn't fall forward all too far. Yep, whoops, that capo can't be there. It's going to have to be in far. There we go. Now, now we can bring it forward here. Pull the cord. There we go. Over so it's not stretched. Pull the cord over so it's not stretched. We're going to have to leave that one go, I think. Unless we do this. Is it working okay for you guys? OBKB, OBKB. Well, okay. we're going to try that. See what happens with that. There you go. Nothing old Dutchman can't fix with some old duct tape and, a wi and, and wire, right? Oh, I didn't That's use either one. Net. I didn't use That's either one of those. Redneck fix. <laughs> Is that a redneck fix? Yeah, just clamp it on there with a 
Guitar capo. Just like, just like uh, Bill Robinson. Uh, this way. You going the wrong way, honey? Yeah, he just comes. I got to scoot over your way. Oh yeah. Well, I could turn it a little more. Should I turn it a little okay. more? It's not. It's not really. It's not centered enough. Oh well. It's okay. Is it okay? All right. Yeah. Well, I want to see more of you though, and less of me. How's that work? Okay, our daughter LaDonna requested his eyes on the sparrow. All right. So you know what, guys? Today was one of them days when I had my moments. And uh, I, I had to ask the Lord to take my mind off the wrong thing and put it on the right thing. And uh, because there's something about this old sentimental guy here. And I know that a lot of you people probably don't even wrestle with it. But there's something about leaving the old and going to the new that can be downright discouraging. But also, I mean, I'm looking for, I love challenges. I've always loved adventures just to see if I can do it. You know, climb up the hill just to see if I can make it. And that kind of thing. But I'm, I'm kind of losing some of that, I guess. <laughs> but anyway, let's not be discouraged. Let's keep on traveling. This um, this whole, anyway, yeah. Talk. Stop talking, start singing, right? Why should I feel and see discouraged? Why should the shadows come? Why? travel schedule guys we're going to leave uh lord willing after church on sunday we're going to i don't like to do this but we're going to head out towards um colorado in our penske truck and unload out there hopefully by tuesday that would be around the six seven seventh eighth eighth or ninth of oh we get to the colorado eight yeah around the eighth and then we're going to lord willing head into missouri but your our schedule the schedule is on living room sing-along with mark and ruth you on facebook to go down a 
bit to get it. This week I'm going to work on getting it finalized and printed out. Things yeah. So that it's easy to find and um, maybe we'll put one of each sing along and you can put requests under that if you're planning to be at the sing along if you want to and yeah try to i'm going to try to work on some of that this week there you go help us out getting that word around if you don't mind and uh yeah you need the colorado address that's right do you have that one yet honey uh, Dorcas's. i'll i'll try to get we it still out. we're still going to be here for two weeks until well um, two weeks three weeks Three weeks, yeah. We're still going to be here, so you can still send us stuff here. It'll get in three weeks, um, or mail, I mean, but um, yeah. Well, probably two weeks till we change it, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, we got to change it. That's true. Anyway, moving right along. Enough about us, but I'm looking forward to the tour. It's, it should be fun. I'm also kind of scared. and Well, I'm not scared, but apprehensive because you never know what could happen. But And I'm not worried about the traveling part. It's more the, uh, the giving the programs and meeting all you wonderful people and, and, and blessing you and and um, allowing you to bless us with your with your insights and your faith and your courage and pray for us if you would please um, that gas thing kind of having like what the world's going on here you know <laughs> but we'll see God is good and He knows what's going on the packing is going great for Ruth and not so great for me today I spent the entire day well we had a I had a meeting with the team that's supposed to replace me the chaplaincy team they're going to go into a team effort more than just um, um more than just me um going on and uh, so i'm so glad for that because there's a lot more that can be done and of course with covid everything has changed and we're coming out we're trying to get things in order so uh special thanks for the people that are there that we're at the meeting trying to get some uh pick up on different things and so yeah, it's going to be quite an interesting process, and I would say my busyness has multiplied exponentially. Is that how you say that word? Where anyway, so we'll see how that goes. Pray for us, Canyon City, Colorado, Marie Landis, and uh, we got the house sold uh, on contract, and the car is supposed to be available Wednesday. So that's what we're looking at now. We put money down on it just a little bit. And um, here again, I had buyer's remorse and everything else, but we found the 2011 um, uh, Chevy Tahoe. It's the wrong color, but hey, you know, and the mileage was right. And uh, it had just come into the lot. They hadn't even had time to clean it or detail it or anything. So they're fixing it up. They had to order a rear window for it because it had uh, the defroster wasn't working. So they're making it right for us. And we're happy about that. And for you local people, it's the Chevy place, Armstrong Chevy in McMinnville here. So we'll put in a little blurt for him. Uh, so treat us right, Lucas. Now you know. <laughs> I'm sure he's not listening. Anyway, moving on, you guys. If you have any more questions, don't hesitate to ask him. <laughs> All right, let's okay. move on. Okay, Evan Yoder requested Holy Spirit. Oh, this is a great song, Evan. <clears throat> Love this song. You know, there's actually verses to that. Mm -hmm. No, no, that's a different song. Oh. Holy, that's in the key of G. Let's do it in the key of G. Holy Spirit, thou art welcome in this place. Holy Spirit, thou art welcome in this place. Omnipotent Father of mercy and grace. And even in living room sing-alongs and, and in our lives every day from day to day. I'm, learn, I'm trying to learn at 63 to be more sensitive 
to hearing him, recognizing his voice and not just my own thought process when he speaks to us in a still small voice or however he does it. He's not in a box. You can't confine him to how he's going to do it. Where are we going next, babes? Or dear? Hey, Mary Penner requested, where could I go? Where could I go but to the Lord? Okay, we're going to do this in D and go on to E. Leaving me low in this old sinful world, hardly a comfort can afford. Striving along to face temptation sore, where could I go but to the Lord? Where could I go? Where could I go? Seeking. For my soul, for my soul, when I'm needing a friend to help me in the end, coming, where could I go but to the Lord? Life here is grand with friends I love so dear. Comfort I get from God's own page from this song in the country and western is that song the old-fashioned meeting i do you do you know this one do you remember it i remember that and i'll tell you i was at some of them quote unquote old-fashioned meetings it could be new fashion meetings where the holy spirit just came in and you felt his presence in your heart it wasn't necessarily a whole bunch of hoop rob it's just the holy spirit came in and there was conviction and there was joy and there was weeping and there was yeah I love when the Holy Spirit really hits the whole crowd at once, right? But anyway, this is called the Old Fashioned Meeting. How's it go? Oh, how well I remember in the Old Fashioned days When some Old Fashioned people had some Old Fashioned ways In this Old Fashioned Meeting as they carried there In this Old Fashioned manner how God answered prayer Was an Old Fashioned Meeting in an Old Fashioned Place where some old fashioned people had some old fashioned grace. As an old fashioned sinner, I began to pray, and God heard me and saved me in the old fashioned way. Heck, I like the word old fashioned. <laughs> oh, that's a fun song. Where are you going next, honey? <clears throat> What did we do? I don't know what we did. <laughs> Sharon her requested sweet hour of prayer. Hey, Sharon, I'll tell you what. I, I need to, I need to, I need to spend more time with the Lord. Every time I sing this song, I get convicted. What's wrong with that picture? <laughs> it's not It's not just time. It's not the hour. It's much of it is what happens in our time and communication with the Lord, is it? What happened? Forgot to mark it. Well, while you do that, it's here. All right, here we are. Okay, I was about to go on the mouth organ. Sweet hour of prayer, Sharon her in the key of C. Sweet hour of prayer, sweet hour of prayer that calls me from a world of care and bids me out. Bye. 
what, um, yeah, that's right, Marion. My sister reminded me how Dad used to take us to some of the old-fashioned tech meetings, and it wasn't just uh, it wasn't just our denomination; it was different denominations. <laughs> it was great. Got some good old solid preaching. I remember that one back in the woods. I don't know if it was a holiness camp or what, man. I tell you, they broke out the old um, the old uh, oh, what you call it? What's that called, honey? <laughs> Uh, uh, accordion. The accordion, yeah. The accordion and the old symbols and everything else. Boy, we had some times praising the Lord there. I remember being fascinated by that as a young man. Anyway, who you got here, hon? Hey, Nelson Good requested the Eastern Gate. Hey, Mr. Nelson liked to sing about that Eastern Gate over there in the key of G. I will meet you in the Until then, yeah, my heart will go on singing. I will keep serving Christ here. Just be ready, watching, and being about our Father's business. Okay, Fern Bauman requested at Calvary. Oh, yeah. At Calvary in the key of C. <clears throat> Years I spent in vanity and pride, caring not my Lord was What a wonderful blessing. Can you believe it? Can you receive it? Casting all your cares on him, for he careth for you at Calvary. Wow. Dying to self. Anyway, go ahead, babes. Okay, Marlon Martin has a 76th birthday, and he requested God on the Mountain. Wow. And Ryan from Saskatchewan also requested this song. In the key of D, God of the Mountain. The 
life is easy when you're up on the mountain and you've got peace of mind like you never know when things change and you're down in such a beautiful song and you know he's he is the god of the good times too sometimes uh we got christians that kind of struggle with this feeling that we should never have good times i believe the apostle paul knew how to laugh in spite of all the th things he suffered and boy did he suffer ay 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 and and even jesus and his disciples i think he laughed some too as a matter of fact there's one place where i bet they kind of broke out with laughter when jesus was telling them about how hard it is for a rich man to get to heaven and uh, I bet you, you know, he said it's harder for a rich man to get to heaven than the eyes of a needle. And I'm wondering if some of them guys didn't yeah. kind of crack up with that, huh? Then a camel. Did I say a camel? You didn't say a camel. I'm um, then a camel going through the eye of the needle. Thank you, babes. I like when you edit my statement. Give me a kiss. Oh, oh that was for you, Tom Reese. <laughs> hey, we're going to the chapel. You see what you get when you kiss? You go to the chapel and you get married. Ay, ay, ay. I always gone to the chapel when we're gonna get married. Gone to the chapel when we're gonna get married. That's the wrong pitch again. I do it every time. I gotta, I gotta write it down there. Go me so gone to the chapel when we're gonna get married. Gone to the chapel.
sun will shine, whoa, I'll be his and he'll be mine. We'll love until the end of time and we'll never be lonely anymore. Come on now. Going to chapel and we're going to get married. Going to the chapel get married, hey, I really love you, and we're gonna get married, gone to the chapel of love, oh yeah, we're gone to the chapel of love, <laughs> there's your love song, guys, that's one of them anyway, Woo. I like that, I like that song, um, let me see, there was something I was gonna say about that, what was it? That yeah, must have been important. All right, another for fun song here called The Mockingbird Hill. I like two things, especially much when it's summertime. I like to hear the birds sing, crickets creep at night, peep. Do they peep or creep? <laughs> creep. <laughs> and I love to see the flowers. We One time we were at Ohio, we were sitting outside, and there's a flower that closes up. At nighttime, that was at my sister Fanny's house in night blooming, night blooming or something, or morning bloom. I don't know. Right. <laughs> and it would close up, and Fanny and, will know. Fanny will know. Night what kind summer. of flower was that, Fanny? Hi, Chris. How do I say this one, honey? When the sun in the morning peeps over the hill and kisses the roses. Fun songs? Oh, you got a Rocky Top there yet? Or is that some other yeah, time? Yeah, that's right. Shall we got do it. that now? Yeah, yeah, we could do that one. And, um, oh, there's Annie's song too. Okay, well, you got that one picked out. Okay, never mind. I was, I was going to drag out a truck driving song. Okay, Sean Miller. Put some diesel Miller. smoke in the wind. Sean Miller requested Rocky Top. Well, you know what? I think I need my capo for this one. Oh, brother. Oh, it's in the case now. Mm -hmm. I think I'll sing it real low. Hello, I'm Johnny Cash. Wish that I was on over Rocky Top down in the Tennessee hills. Ain't no smoky smoke on Rocky Top. Ain't no telephone bill. Once I had a girl on Rocky Top and there the other half cat. Wild as a soda, sweet as a soda pop, I still dream about that. Rocky 
those flowers were uh, well, come in the she, evening she they close up evening primrose oh evening primrose oh okay that too okay yeah. hey here's another love song you guys and i know that i hope you don't groan some of you folks are like man i wish they'd quit being so mushy but we're old enough that it don't matter we're allowed to be see that's what it is so Any we age doesn't matter well age don't matter okay never mind never <laughs> mind she's right she's right john denner wrote this for his wife first wife sad story there but anyway it's the song of solomon song kind of a little bit where it talks about how being together both emotionally physically and spiritually you fill up my senses like a night in the forest who is this for like a mountain in Like a walk in the rain, like a storm in the desert, like a sleepy blue ocean. You fill up my senses, come fill me again, so come let me. these replays she is one of the residents on first floor that i love to hang out with she loves music and what we do i've started doing most of your um screens in the rooms down there have usb plugs so i try to put a bunch of sing-alongs on there and plug them in uh, for the people to the, the residents to watch and so far i've done that for about i think three different people and they love it and uh, so I, I go to the dining room and and lolita the other day she said 
I never heard that song, How Far Is Heaven. I like that. Can you sing it for me? <laughs> so we did. And the reason she likes it especially much is her husband, Walter, just passed away about six months ago. Not even that long ago. Three months. We missed that guy. Oh, yo, yo. Anyway, we, the lighthouse for you, Miss uh, Susanna, right? There's a lighthouse on the hillside that overlooks life's sea. When I'm tossed, it sends out a light, a light that I might see. And the light that shines in darkness now will safely lead us o'er. If it wasn't for that old lighthouse, then my ship would be Everybody that lives around us says we ought to tear that old lighthouse down. You know the big ships don't sail this way anymore, and there's no use of it standing around. But then my mind goes back to that stormy night when just in time I saw the light. Yes, the light. We got some gorgeous lighthouses out here along the West Coast. A lot of them are not in use anymore. Matter of fact, last Sunday I uh, delivered or gave a message, preached a message on uh, a parable called, or we used a parable called the Life Saving Station. Found it on a, on a PowerPoint on um, online, and I loved it. And I just build kind of build the message around that. When does the Life Saving Station? changed to be a social club and no longer gives light out and rescues the ones who are in shipwreck out in the sea. That's a challenge for all of us. All righty, hon, where are we going next? Okay, Janine Adams requested, what a friend we have. Ah, Mrs. Adams, yes, Janine. Here we go, what a friend we have in Jesus. Let's do this one in the key of E, I think. Yeah. What a friend we have in
time now when we sing this song it was written by marjorie wilkins and chris christian mark 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 mary john mary john mary jane mary john mary john. Mary jane? Mary john. Mary john anyway so do we say just a woman or just a man oh all right i'll sing man you sing woman all right whoops try that again in the key of c necessarily we're praying for or not for yesterday's but for today's so it is one day at a time and i know some of you had to face a lot of tough times that way our prayers and hearts go out to the um kathy gaylor uh, his brother passed away michael gaylor that's his name goes out to the gaylor family and also of course to the um arlen and janet to the arlen uh, yoder family 
uh, who Arliss. Arliss, I'm sorry, you're right. Thank you, Arliss Schroeder family. And there's others of you that are saying goodbye. It seems like that comes up on the living room sing along a good bit when you think about some of these old songs and how the uh, folks love them. Love will bring us all together. This is a newer one, but I love it. And I think you got some lines on here. We're gonna do it in the key of D. All things work together for good when God's love is understood. God is good and everything he does is right. Springtime flowers build and fade, but the memories that they make are for ray of sunshine in Some good requests in that, aren't we, guys? Carlos right. Schooley and Bertha Mer Metzler. Mertzler. So I'm going to request Thrive for next Tuesday, Thursday night. I'm, I'm wanting to feel like singing that song again. I, won't, I might not next Thursday night, though. Okay, they requested Our God, He is Alive. Yeah, now who is that again? I'm sorry, I distracted. Carlos Schooley and, and Bertha Mertzler. All right. Two of them. You want to sing about God being alive? We'll sing about God being alive. I love it. Let me see. Fat boys eat apple dumplings D flat. Let's do this in the key of C, I think. To me so there is beyond the azure blue. just alive he's active caring and working and loving all of us working in our lives using us for his glory 
Okay, Susanna Griffith requested standing on the promises. Man, it's good tonight to just sit down here for me and just kind of rest and just get away from all the other stuff and focus on this. Thank you for joining us tonight, you guys. <clears throat> standing on the promises. Susanna, did you say? Susanna. Here we go. Standing on the promises, key of G. Standing on the promises of Christ my King Through eternal ages let His praises ring Glory in the highest I will shout and sing Standing on the promises of God I didn't think about it in time. Here we go. Standing on the promises I cannot fail When the howling storms of doubt and fear assail By the living word of God I shall prevail Standing on the promises of God One more time. Standing on His promises you guys he will take care I will take care of you I will watch over you boy there's so many of them okay. name him name some tonight and claim him go ahead babes Miriam Trossel requested because he lives because he lives Miriam Trossel this is for you in the key of G God sent his son they called him Jesus he came to Hey, Veronica <clears throat> requested 
for those tears I died. Oh, yeah. We've all shed a tear or two in our lives, haven't we? If not outside, inside we have. You said, yeah. You said you'd come and share all my sorrows. You said you'd be there for all my tomorrows. I came so close to sending you but just like you promised, you came there to stay. I just had to pray. And Jesus said, come to the water, stand by my side. I know you are thirsty, you won't be denied. I fell One of the three we can we do? Two more. Oh, only two more? Oh, you guys. I didn't realize it was this late. I was having too much fun. Sorry. Okay. When, no, whoop, go ahead. Daniel Tabitha, you to request it when the roll is called a When the trumpet of the Lord shall sound and time shall be no more. And the morning breaks eternal right and fair. When the Savior shall gather over on the other shore. with something for Jeff, Jeff Davis and all the rest of you. Thank you, Lord, for your blessings on me. In the key of G, while the world looks upon me as I struggle along, they say I have nothing, but they are so wrong in my heart. Yeah. Hey. 
wealthy and these clothes they're not new. I don't have much money, but Lord, I have you. And to me, that's all that matters, though the world may not see. Thank you, Lord, for your blessings on me. Cause there's a Thank you, Lord, for your blessings on us. Father God, we thank you for the way that you've been here with us tonight and spoken to our hearts. We pray for each one in the living room sing-along, for comfort, for strength, for courage, and for your Holy Spirit to anoint and guide all of us as we go on. We want to be part of the church that is alive, Lord, part of the family of God that honors you and has Jesus at the head. So we praise you tonight, Jesus, for your presence. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you all. Thanks for joining us. And boy, oh boy. Ah, man, 25 minutes. Too long. My butt's starting to feel it too. Whoops, you didn't turn it off yet.